Welcome back. High oil prices continue to fuel inflation around the world as consumer nations seek more supply. The increase in the demand for crude is also creating a shortage of oil rigs in the Gulf and around the world. Oil producers can't find them fast enough. As Wolf Dinnick reports, it's a good time to be in the oil rig business. This is a rare sight these days. A brand new oil rig ready to drill and pull up valuable oil. Peter Convery, the president and CEO of Maritime Industrial Services, says his phone has not stopped ringing since he added rig construction to his business. He cannot keep up with demand. The last surge in, in, the, in the oil market was in the, in the 80s, uh, when this region wasn't a developed region for, for that type of industry. The United Arab Emirates, where these rigs are being built, now has the labor, infrastructure and resources to build them in the Gulf where new demand is especially high. Companies around the world are looking to expand drilling to cash in on the high oil prices. Due to the shortage here in the Gulf, rigs are being brought in from far away as Trinidad, Singapore and India. And the problem is, if you can't rent one, it takes two years to have one made at a cost of $500 million. Many of the rental contracts are being locked into five-year terms with the belief that oil will stay above $100 a barrel for some time. For more than 20 years, Dubai-based Jim Larson has worked in the oil rig business. And with the excess cash that's being generated by $100 plus oils for the majors and the, and the uh, governments in the area, uh, they're increasing their, their developments and that's what's uh, increasing the demand. For many years, when oil prices were low, there was very little investment in the oil industry. Now they're playing catch-up. It's very significant, for instance, in, in the exploration part, where, where people to operate, engineers and, and, and technicians to operate these rigs are in a shortage. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, that's also a thing that takes a long time to, uh, to rectify. Making matters even worse, many of the rigs operating are outdated. Well, a lot of the rigs that are in the market are now 25 plus years old. So that there requires an uh, upgrade of those rigs and indeed replacement of those rigs. So we're going to have uh, rigs which are, which are going out of the market. It takes Maritime Industrial Services more than two years from order to delivery. And they can only build three at a time due to space. Hardly enough to make a dent in the market. Industry analysts estimate it will take 40 new rigs to ease demand. And that's not expected to happen until 2011. But if oil prices continue to climb, even that may not be enough rigs. Wilfton X CNN, Dubai. And next week on Marketplace Middle East, dilemma in Turkey. Will a pending lawsuit derail Turkey's economic expansion? Shems El Wazir looks at the case and how it relates to the country's cultural tug of war. Be sure to tune in for that. And for another chance to see any of our stories, please visit our website. It's cnn.com slash MME or send your comments via email at mme at cnn.com. Thanks for joining us for this edition of CNN Marketplace Middle East. I'm John Defterius. We'll see you next week.